like to be honest with you, I can feel the pressure. I can identify with the challenges that you are going through at this time in this pandemic with this virus. Uh, we would have thought maybe by now it would have gone away, but the reality it is still here and it's causing enormous stress for some of us. For some of you, you may feel as though you are drowning in stress. Some of you may feel you're drowned in, in depression. You may be drowned in, in hopelessness. You may feel no one cares about your situation or your circumstances. But I'm here just to encourage you that God is with you. And it doesn't matter how many challenges come your way. You can place your faith and your confidence in Him. So even when you feel as though you are going under, He's well able to rescue you. He's well able to deliver you. I want to encourage our young people to place your trust and your confidence in the Lord. This world system, like a ship, is going down. What God wants to do is save the people. So I want to encourage you to give your life to the Lord Jesus Christ. And you have purpose. I'm going to just show you something I observed yesterday. And it caused me again to be encouraged in spite of my situation, in spite of circumstances, in spite of whatever comes to bring me down, to sink me, that God is really able to cause me to float again. Live your life with purpose. Dream. Put God in all your plans. And acknowledge Him in all your ways and allow Him to direct your path. I want to say to you, even though you may feel overwhelmed sometimes, even though you may make decisions that will cause you, as it were, to go under, as though you are drumming, as though you have no purpose, as though you have no life, as though you have no meaning, you want out of the abuse, maybe drugs, something that is contrary and causing harm to your life. God is able to pick you up and to cause you to float above the situation. If you notice, I have not been moved out, but guess what? I am moved just above. So God is well able to keep you above. Continue to trust Him and may His will be done in your life. Remember how man think it in his heart? So you see, the quality of your decision will determine the quality of your life. The quality of your life will be determined by the source of your influence. In Jesus' name, bless you.